Hi, in this video, we're going to download Visual Studio so that we can use it inside of Unity for coding and stuff. All right, so let's get into it. So you open the browser and then you search for Visual Studio Community. And you can see that the latest version as of recording this video is Visual Studio 2022. So I'll click on this and then hit download. I recommend using Visual Studio over Visual Studio Code or even other IDEs because it has stuff that lets you integrate much better with Unity. Just a quick tip, if you are working on a lower end machine or a laptop or something, I recommend using Visual Studio Code because it uh, needs less resources compared to Visual Studio. But getting used to Visual Studio is much better because that is industry standard if you are looking for jobs or something. It has much better integration and debugging tools that we can use inside Unity. It's not something that we learn as a beginner, but it's something that you may want to know once you are really into game development and stuff. All right, so you just hit continue. So once you open up the installer, it's going to ask you this. It's going to give you this window and now you have to select game development with Unity. So you need to scroll down. If you are working with Unreal Engine or stuff, you need to make sure this is also selected. Uh, I'm not going to do that and then hit install. And it is going to download everything and uh, it's going to install it. As you can see, Visual Studio got installed and it's opening right now. And it'll ask you to sign in, which I recommend you to do. And I'm just going to close the Visual Studio for now and let's see how we can set it up inside Unity. So the way we're going to do is open your project. You need to go to edit, preferences, and then you need to go out to external tools. All right. And Visual Studio is automatically selected for me. If it's not selected for you, you just need to go to browse. Then you need to go to C, program files, Microsoft Visual Studio 2022, uh, community, and I believe it's in common seven, IDE. It's dev and developer environment, I believe. And if you select that, it's going to be the same, all right. So you need to make sure this is selected and just to test it out, I'll create a C sharp script. I'll, I'll name it. Um, uh, and if you open it up, um, you can see that Visual Studio opens with our code. It's supposed to load, but yeah, you get the point, right? It's going to open up uh, Visual Studio like this. And here we are with the code. Just a quick note, the debugging thing that I want to talk to you about is attaching to Unity. You can do this and then uh, build your stuff. It, it's really great for debugging. So you don't have to do it if you're starting it out. And just in case if your theme is not dark, you can just go to tools, I believe. Options and yeah, go to environment general. And then there is this color theme called dark. You can change it to anything that you like and Oh my God, this is so I'll, I'll change it back to dark. Dark is the way to go always. So I hope this video was useful. So I'm going to start how to learn C sharp in my channel for beginners. So this video is just the very first video for those people who don't know how to install Visual Studio. It's going to be useful for beginners and intermediates. And if you are interested in that, please do subscribe and stay tuned for that. Uh, I'll be uploading it soon. So thank you for watching. Have a nice day.